I want to be clear, this video will be based on my opinions and theories and should only be taken as just that. You can let me know your opinions too, in the comments. If you haven't watched part 1 of this video, I recommend watching that one first. Link will be in the description. I still have more clips to show you and just like the last video I will indicate any sounds with the icon of headphones. Then we will look at the video I've been asked to address where it appears Luna is getting aggressive with Rainbow and I will discuss my opinion in what I think is happening. All these clips are from videos within the last few days. You may have already formed an opinion on what is happening in the Savannah troupe. Here's the reason why I've been showing Joyce so much. You have now heard her name being called in the background along with mysterious noises. This is Joyce and clearly she's not acting like her energetic self, like I've shown in previous clips. Her eye seems to be getting swollen. Was it a coincidence that we heard her name being called with all those noises, and now this? Poor girl, seems like she can't get comfortable to take a nap. Here's some clips from a day or two previously, and pay attention to the vibe of these monkeys. We can only speculate what is going on. But if you look at these monkeys' facial expressions and reactions, the overall energy they portray shows something isn't right. Something has them worried. Of course the VO is covering the mic of the camera. There's obviously something going on that they don't want us to hear. Luna is keeping Rainbow close and I think that is Jimmy who is screaming. What is happening here? Why is Luna extra protective? When Rainbow gets nervous and starts freaking out, she is very hard to manage and hard to control. We see this all the time with Libby, where it looks like Libby is trying to hurt Rainbow. But she is actually trying to get her away from the VOs and to comply. Now we're seeing how Luna tries to get Rainbow to comply. This is a personality flaw in Rainbow. She is just a little fighter, but this makes it hard for other monkeys to protect her. You see Luna is nipping at Rainbow and holding her tight. She's trying to keep Rainbow with her. She's not piercing the skin or injuring her as she bites. Biting looks cruel but it's actually beneficial. This helps build a pain tolerance. So, if in the future, 
she were to be attacked by another monkey, she will be able to defend herself while injured. Biting and teaching babies in this way is not a bad thing. It's actually really good as these are wild animals and not humans. Even if they were once pets, they still have wild instincts. Here is Joyce trying to protect Rainbow now. It always looks like monkeys are trying to hurt Rainbow. It's all about getting her to comply which isn't easy at all. Although she isn't there, Libby is respected in the Savannah Troop. Therefore, many monkeys in the Savannah Troop are willing to help protect Rainbow. I think many monkeys see Rainbow as higher ranking. The VOs always make their lives stressful, in my opinion. ตัวนี้ <coughs> 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 I don't know if you saw it, but something is there. Something that is even spooking Katrina. Is it a dog? What is going on and why are they chasing after Joyce so much?
This isn't normal for Luna. There is something going on that is making these monkeys so stressed, in my opinion. If there is one thing I can tell Rainbow hates, it's when she is scared and then there's giant humans in a group surrounding her with nowhere to go. Imagine how it must feel to have dangerous giant feet and feel like you're backed into a corner and about to be stomped on. That's how I think she feels. They need to back off and give her space. It doesn't matter what monkey is there to protect her. She must feel like her life is in danger. This is not caused by the monkey nipping at her and trying to get her to comply. This is caused by the VOs chasing her and then surrounding her like this. Now to the video that I was asked to address. This is probably the most aggressive I've seen Luna towards Rainbow and honestly, I believe it's just the same old thing. Rainbow is scared and people are surrounding her. She feels like she is in danger and she won't comply with those who are trying to protect her and again all is caused by the VOs. On top of that, they're doing something that is also scaring Luna, which only causes Luna to lose her composure. This is what they do to Libby all the time and how ironic I was saying in my previous videos that they were not bothering Luna and Rainbow together. Well I guess they've decided it was too boring to allow the monkeys to live their life peacefully and now decided to cause havoc. It's sad that they're doing it to Luna too. This is the sad reality of what will happen when Katrina and Luna give birth. We've now heard time and time again of VOs making awful noises to scare the monkeys. They chase them down, surround them, and do whatever other horrible things that they could possibly do, outside of the camera's view. Do they really believe people want to see this? Just sickos maybe. In my opinion, these VOs are so selfish. Joyce seems to want to come to Rainbow's aid and seems to be trying to tell Luna to stop.
Chasing after the two of them like this only makes the situation worse. Luna was trying to get Rainbow to settle down. Well, she can't. The selfish giants are coming with the flip flop feet, stomping frantically behind them like a stampede. Do you hear them laughing? These are grown men. Rainbow is just a baby, is a monkey, and she is even more mature than them. 
It just shows that this is all just a game for them. They don't care about these monkeys. In my opinion. If Luna were trying to hurt Rainbow, she would be severely injured by now. Do you hear that? They are literally calling Joyce over, they want to keep egging this on. One thing about this makes me happy. It shows me that Luna will be a great protective mother. Luna has one strong grip. Libby usually tries to settle this by grooming her but Libby usually loses grip on Rainbow pretty fast. Rainbow is still a baby and sadly, until she is big enough to properly defend herself, she will be very complicated to protect. This is Rainbow's biggest downfall. <laughs> Luna isn't even phased by Joyce that much. Her focus is on Rainbow. There really is something very endearing about that. It's just sad that this has to be the situation though. Yes, Rainbow is a little hurt but, it would be far worse if Luna had the intentions to hurt her. There are many videos of actual battles between monkeys. This is not what it looks like when a monkey intends to hurt another monkey. This was a frantic attempt to keep Rainbow safe. An attempt to protect a baby that isn't compliant to the one protecting her. In my opinion, Rainbow has no clue what is happening. <laughs> 